Cadê o 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 I'm gonna call my boss when I get home. I don't know what he's talking about. I don't know what he is talking about. Mm, 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 mm. He be tripping. Talking about second pool. What are you talking about? Man, I'll tell you what. Folks, he ain't even my boss. He just like complaining. Just like complaining. Talking about he gotta show me something. Man. I'll tell you what. I'm sure gonna call my boss when I get home. I'ma just let him know how he be doing cause he act like he my boss, man. You're not my boss. I literally touched everything in that store. And he talking about he gotta show me a few things. Man. Show me a few things, my butt. I'm gonna tell him how he be doing. He, I'm telling him. I'm gonna tell my boss that he's really, he's really starting to, he's starting to get on my nerves because he, he acting like he's my boss. He's not my boss. I got to where I don't even want to see him, and I, I'm pretty sure that gets, that gets, get on, get on his nerves because he don't get to see me, and get to complain about stuff. You know, get on. I'm, I'm so gonna call my boss when I get home. He tripping. Talking about a second pool. You know, good and well, that store don't sell nothing. You don't even gotta do a second pool there, it'd be so slow. He just wanna complain about something. I don't even wanna go give me no Taco Bell right now, because I'm, I'm ready to call my boss. I hope y'all heard how he was talking. He, he just, y'all probably didn't hear it. Hopefully y'all heard it. He just making up stuff. Have to show me a few things. Man. Ain't my fault you don't be sending the right stuff. Ain't nothing you gotta show me. You done messed my whole mood up. That's my whole mood up.
You're talking about a second pool, man. It's 11 o'clock. <laughs> I just got done. Like, ain't nothing gonna be sold. The back room is literally empty. There's nothing I can put out. Except fill spots in with drinks I don't got, which they don't want you to do that. you were <laughs> like I don't get it y'all like you're not my boss like if you want to complain about something call my boss tell my boss and let my boss talk to me cuz you're not my boss man my boss don't even call me that much Like I said, he's making it to where like I, I avoid him. I don't even want to see him. Like I'll get done and go sit in the car till he gone and then I eventually go back in the store. Cause that's all he do is nitpick. That's all he do, nitpick. I don't know why he likes that. Then he don't send in all the drinks you need. Like today, he didn't send no Dr. Pepper Zero. So I had to spray the diet Dr. Pepper out and it didn't even fill the shelves up. I don't get it. Like I said, and he just wanna talk, 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 talk. Like, I don't wanna talk. Yeah, I'm gonna call my boss when I get home. I'm gonna tell him he's starting to make it where I just wanna avoid him, like, I don't know. My boss don't even call me and text me as much as he do. And I'm just saying, he's not my boss. <laughs> like, what's your problem? He called me twice and then he texted me. Like, dude, what's your problem? I just wanted to call him back and see what he had to complain about. I usually just, I usually just laugh it off, but he's starting to get on my nerves. He's really starting to get on my nerves. It's, it's starting to get old. I might even not call my boss because if I call him, I'm, I'm just gonna let him know that like he, he's getting on my nerves. Like, dude, like what's your problem? Like I said, my boss don't even call me, call me and text me as much as he do. Like, dude. So hot right now, y'all. Hmm. 
And he does it all the time. Like, it's just crazy. Like I said, I think it kind of make him upset that he don't get to see me and talk to me, which sounds kind of weird. But like I said, all he want to do is complain. That's all he want to do is just complain. Tell me what I didn't do, what I need to do. And you not my boss. <laughs> like, dude, chill out. Dang. I don't get it, y'all. Like I said, it's really starting to, it's starting to, it's starting to get old. That's what it's starting to do. I like my job and everything. But that's the only thing that, like, I don't know how a job this easy, somebody finds something to make it harder or something to just complain about all the time. Like, I literally put out everything he sent me today. And he gonna complain about how the drinks on the shelves when there's drinks in the wrong spot. So I try to put in the drinks that's supposed to go there. I'm not gonna move all that stuff. He got drinks in the wrong spot. See, it's not my store. I come to the store when the dude is off. So I'm there when he off. So basically the store is how he wanted. So I'm coming in behind him somewhat fixing having to try to fix some of the mistakes he did, if that makes sense. I don't get it. I don't get it, I don't get it. It's always somebody, it's always somebody on the job that find, that try to find a way to make it difficult. He see that I do my work and I get my work done. And that's it. Man, that Kroger's is literally so slow. Like, dude, chill out. Side by side. <laughs> uh. I don't get it, y'all. I don't get it, I don't get it. Like his job is to order drinks. That's all his job is, is to order drinks. <laughs> but yet he find a way to, to start a conflict, some kind of conflict. When all he gotta do is order drink. Man. You see how I told him at first I just ran down the road? See, that's the stuff I kinda usually do. But he he don't he pissed he he really just pissed me off, to be true. I'm talking about he got something to show me. Asked me did I pull this down and pull that down. Yeah, I pulled it down. Ain't the shelf full? He don't even know what he got in his own store. And he want to chit chat with you and ask you what he needs. He want me to do his job. I don't get paid to do his job. I get paid to merchandise, to put out drinks. I don't get paid to order drinks and chit chat about nothing and hear you complain all day when you're not even my boss like I said I seriously I got to where I just avoid them and it's been like this it's been like this for a while I avoid them because I don't want to go off on them <laughs> But he, I, I almost went off on him right there. 
why I told him I'm gonna call my boss. Like, dude, if you got a problem, we talk to my boss. I don't even want to talk to you. You are not my boss. I wish I would turn around. Now, my boss called me, I'm going to turn around. That's a fact. But I'm not turning around for him. I wish I would turn around. Man, oh man. Hmm. Yeah, I gotta call my boss. I, I gotta let him know how how he does, like. It don't make no sense. It really don't make no sense. Like I said, he want to see you and talk to you. Like, dude, I don't want to, I don't want to sit and talk with you, talk about nothing. And here you complain. That's all he do is complain. I don't see how he can make that such a hard, such a hard job. Like all he do is order drinks, but he finds a way to try to bring some conflict in, complaining all the time. That's what I told him. I, everything looked good to me. I'm talking about he got to show me something, dude. I wish I would turn around. He know good and well that store so slow. Talking about I gotta do a second pull. Second pull on my butt. And the guy that's there all the time, I know darn well he don't do no second pull. Now at the other programs I do, you for sure gotta do a second pull because it's busy. That Kroger's not busy and I literally put out everything that I could today. So why would I sit around and stay at work? Why would I stay and fill the shelves with drinks that's not supposed to go there? Because he didn't send no Sprite Zero. He didn't send no Dr. Pepper Zero. He didn't send enough diet, Dr. Pepper. And the stuff that was already on the shelf, it was already spread out. Because like I said, it's not my store. So like the, he already had some stuff spread it all the way out. I put out all the 12 packs I could, could, I could put out. But that would give him something else to complain because it would be stuff in the wrong spot. Man. Let me mess around and hit the lottery. <laughs> I said in the other video, I would probably keep my job, but man, I'll find something else to occupy my time with for as working wise, if I mess around and hit the lottery. <laughs> Cross our fingers. Well, I tell you, I mess around and hit the lottery one day. Be out of there. Ooh. I don't even know what to talk about, y'all. That literally, really, done hurt my nerves. Other than that, like I said, I had a good day. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna go to Taco Bell. I just find something to eat at home. That can pull my butt.
guess he just want me to ride the clock. There's nothing else for me to do. Like I said, I don't get it. Almost home, y'all. Probably about another maybe 20 minutes at the most. I'll be home. I said, I don't even know what to talk about now, y'all. Don't ruin my whole mood. Don't ruin my whole mood. I'll probably speed this part of the video up, y'all. I don't got too much of nothing to say.
a nice truck, y'all. <laughs> like I said, I don't even know what to talk about right now. Man. Made me not even want to go get nothing to eat. Wind cutting, y'all. I know it did say it was gonna have like 11 mile per hour winds today. That's just why I feel so. I don't know. Before my mood got changed. That's why the ride seemed kind of different because it's so windy out right now. Gonna put them went to sleep. <laughs> I ain't never had that happen. Is that a Hellcat, y'all? Looks like a Hellcat. Coca Cola. I don't know, y'all. It's always something. Always something. Excuse my language, homeboy can't see or something. I 
I don't know if he was on the phone or what. Find me something to eat, y'all. I don't know. About two, probably about a month ago, my boss asked me was everything okay, and I, I, I told him everything was okay. He asked me about my schedule and stuff, cause I, I literally wait. I work every weekend. It's been like this for. What going on almost? I don't know, three years. So maybe I need to get on a different route or something. I don't know. I don't know, yo. I really don't know. Park the motorcycle on the porch and we find somewhere else to park. I park beside my car. <sighs> All right, y'all. I catch y'all later. Y'all be good.